And we are good. Mostly. Thank you, Lacarius. Darn, I was hoping that I'd make it into the capture. <laughs> it did. I started good. recording, I just full screened. We're live. And Got it's him. not like I can edit this or anything. Prank. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's not like I can edit a bag of chips on Seth's sword frame by frame. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> ah, by the way, did you get your Vegeta? <laughs> did you get your Vegeta voice ready? Last this episode, you said- like weirdly- yeah, I was just remember that now. Actually, Dragon Ball yesterday, so. Kakoroto. Yeah, it's like weirdly high pitched. I think. <laughs> I don't know if I could Screw actually France. pull it off though. Screw Franz. <laughs> Rip Franz. The main ones I want to level up are Gilliam and Erica. I remember I watched this person do like a randomized like sacred stones, and it was like from a fan of his, and like they specifically made an Amelia that was trainee forever, and she summoned other Amelias. What? <laughs> so she became a summoner somehow? Yeah. It was just a bunch of trainee Amelias, and they didn't really do anything. <laughs> I mean, you He's can. Like, oh, I'm really a cool. Crack the enemy, go! You can keep them the trainee class. Well, yeah, Random but, like, it's just so bizarre. Yeah, it's so crazy. But uh, France was like a soldier, and he was just like he wasn't even bad. He was like super fast, but he had like zero attack. <laughs> <laughs> Game sucks. <laughs> Gotta use those high weapon mites. It's like, oh, you yeah. just get boned for one stat and yeah. just make some entire <laughs> Like everything's good, but they can't do damage. Or they can't hit. Basically. So what is this? Chapter two? No, it's chapter one. The first one didn't count because it was Oh right, right. Prologue. <laughs> but it also took like a minute when it sped up. No, I was looking at the uh, Oliver and Heroes and just kind of thinking, wow, uh, he's like just a worse version of, um, <laughs> what's her face, Gunthra. Because they share similar stats, except her speed is way higher. And she has yes. the movement abilities, and it's just like, why? <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know. Oliver is so useless. <laughs> like, and he doesn't even have like good things for inheritance either. Unless like nope. mirror strike is something you'd like, but not really. And I'm just like, oh, now he's just gonna sit here in my barracks, just there. Yeah, like, I gotta pass attack him ploy time. or whatever. Yeah, but he's gonna be five stars. I ain't wasting no feathers on Oliver. Fuck that bullshit. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> he can stay there in my barracks, right next to my 20 million other characters that I don't use. I managed to pull a five star Kata and I was really disappointed. Wish be a plus tack at least. I didn't even check. I don't want to use her. I, I don't know, her wing sword thing is pretty cool. I really like oh, it. Oh, Tati, guess to... what? What? I finally started playing heroes again. <gasps> yeah! Did oh, you wait. get Hexer? It get... No, yeah, that's where it gets good. <laughs> Essentially, you see, I summoned uh, from the Valentine's Day banner, and I got two of uh -huh. the focus units. Guess which one I didn't get? Hector! Yeah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> what did you get, Lolina? Oh, yeah. She's really good. She hits yeah, pretty good. Hard. I don't care. I mean, I would summon for her if she wasn't a horse mage. I don't care for horse mages. I hate them. Get this Oops. out of my house. Blah, I say nonsense. Blah. 
but Roy is good. He's good boy. He's very strong. I got Roy too. Yes, he's good boy. I hope he's plus attack. <laughs> and then there's Lynn, that I also don't really care about. <laughs> she is plus defense minus res. <laughs> well, <laughs> I don't yep. know about that one. <laughs> pretty, pretty mediocre. Pretty whatever. Yeah, plus defense. What the f <laughs> That sucks. Time to just let her sit there. Yep. And it's weird because, like, like, I've gotten so many Kadas, and they're always others. like, every single Kada is like, fucking minus attack. And I'm like, why? She already has like two attack. Why this, you gotta do this to me? This can't be. I. This can't be. Commander Baguette. Yeah, I love Baguette. <laughs> Though good for him, he broke the stereotype, he didn't surrender. <laughs> we did it! Now we can save the hot chick. <laughs> <laughs> Princess time! That's your Vegeta. I have no idea. I, I have no clue how to do a Vegeta voice in Japanese, but English. I'm just so confused. <laughs> what? This power? <laughs> this power? Sargillium! <laughs> I don't even know if I was voicing her last time. I think you were. I think you were. I'm sorry, I never meant to cause you such trouble. It was no trouble. I live to serve, princess. I guess that's what we'll go with. <laughs> Tana! <laughs> oh. Tana! <laughs> Erica! You got something in your throat. <laughs> <laughs> Is that really you? <laughs> Unfortunately. Tata, what are you doing so far from Castle Frelio? I heard the grenades have fallen. I was so worried. But I'm glad to see that. <laughs> I'm glad to see you're safe. <laughs> no. Wait, where's the frame? Is he well? Has he been taking care of his abs? Uh, his abs are pretty sick. <laughs> what? I, I wish I knew where he was, though. <laughs> Heaven heard from him. Oh, I hope he's not being harmed. He can handle himself. Come on, we must go to Castle Frelia. The Lord of Father may know something. So we can defeat Dr. Wiley. Dr. Willy? Ah, uh, oh, Willy. Thank you, Tana. Yeah, to those saying Awakening was the first uh, game with a map, not true. It was Sacred Dragon. Right. Uh, obviously. Anyways, alongside Prince Son of Aurelia, they ride to the Frelian capital. He wants to do his voice. so ugly. <laughs> Why did he do this? <laughs> He's so bad in here. They're breaking up a bit. Curious? Uh huh? What? Which one of you wants to do his voice, or should I just do it? I have a bunch the best already. Voice. Okay, I'll do it. <laughs> oh, Tana, I'm grateful to see that you're safe and home again. You've no idea how worried when I heard you were under attack by at Border of Ruan. You are not to leave again without my permission. Do you understand? Don't be mad, father! Look, I come bearing good news! Oh ho! Oh. <laughs> Erica, come on now! Now she's just gonna be Mickey Mouse. <laughs> oh no! Uh, King, King Hale, I'm pleased to see you again, even in these sad times. Ah, Erica, it does my heart to good, good to see you safe. However, Purity has not been kind on you. Thank you. I was able to escape the castle before Renee's fell. Oh. But see, that I'm not sure if my father. Ah! Nothing. Yes. <laughs> I, I have received word of your father. Your Highness? P please tell me. Is my father well? No. My friend King Fado did not survive the fall of Renee's castle. No, it cannot be. Well, that's a name. 
<laughs> Dibs on his daughter. Dibs! <laughs> Rest assured, Crater will be punished for its cowardly act. This is, for, this is for Aria's promise. Erica, please. please stay here and rest. I cannot imagine how exhausted you must be. Oh. <gasps> Stop freezing, King Hazen. You know of the Prince Ephraim's disappearance, do you not? Yes, we hear the prince and his men hound Grado at every turn. It's said that he's led his forces into the Empire itself. Reports suggest he's crossed the border and now fights in Renval. My brother, he fights on, even now. Yes, my Pegasus Knights bought this information at a great price. Even though like Mace has fallen, 30, gold. he charges into the enemy's <laughs> heart. Which is what it cost him. His true Vipedo son, or a valiant. I wish that I knew whether he remains un- Sorry, at first I thought that was unarmed. <laughs> but I did Yeah, not. hope not. <laughs> King Hayden, I thank you for your offer, but I cannot stay. But I intend to ride to my brother's side with reinforcements. I cannot allow it. I know how you feel, but this plan is suicide. It would be betraying Fado's memory if I allowed any harm to befall you. Stay here, rest and mourn. Leave this war to the warriors. Oh. I, I know you mean well, your majesty. However, I, I have lost my father and my twin brother is in peril. My brother, he is a part of me. Ugh. Oh. I cannot rest here in peace while he risks his life. His can't just be normal. No, nope, <laughs> I'm the same. Not. <laughs> no, Rene has no more army. Kratos forces decimated him. I wish that Fuerwia could provide you with support. <laughs> with soldiers. Fuerwia. <laughs> but my son, Inns, is on his way to meet Vampire's forces. Okay, why don't the kings in this game do anything? It's always the kids, just like, Son! Could you go take out the army? Old, oh, that's come why. on, Dad. I mean, even so, like... Uh, you're still the king. He's gotta sit there and do king things, you know, sit on the throne, <laughs> do make sure the people are awake. Yeah, basically. It's <laughs> like, <laughs> taxes. <laughs> Which is so ironic, nice. because the tax go to... So... <laughs> Gosh, there you go. If I raise my taxes by 10%, I'm going to kill myself. Ugh. Rip. We cannot spare a single brigade. Plus, I have to do my taxes. Yeah, you know, King Things. I you see. Are so determined to go? I'll tax you. Yes. With apologies. As resolute as your father, huh? What am I to do in the face of such foolhardy determination? Vanessa! Oh, hello. Okay, you can take her, Tati. Here, your highness. Mulder. You called, my king? Oh, boy! <laughs> <laughs> Look at this guy! Yeah! Gilliam. Oops. Yes, sir. You are to accompany Princess Erica of Renace into Grado territory. I expect each of you to provide aid and support for her brother. Quite a grave responsibility you've given us. What was that about Bartray? This guy is just as pretty as Bartray. Oh gosh, Rocky, I swear if you send me a picture of Summer Mulder, I will frickin' block you. What? Is that a challenge? Dear yeah, God, no, I hope I can not. Do it. No, it's a begging. I beg you not to. <laughs> He's begging you. <laughs> Don't scar him any more than Our we lives are yours. <laughs> These are some of my most trusted and stalwart vassals. It'd which... probably just be him, like in a, a flower shirt, whatever. <laughs> The Hawaiian t shirt. Like, uh, yeah, those. Just get out. Of here. And just like cargo pants or shorts, whatever. 
<laughs> Can hear tonight. Thank you. I'll save your thanks for your return with your brother, Quincy Frame. Yes, your highness. Yes. Nice money. We'll buy more chips. Erica, you don't really intend to go through this, do you? What? Huh? <laughs> I can't guess how you must feel, but this is too dangerous. What would happen if you were captured by Greedo's men? Uh -huh. uh, th thank you for your concern, Tama. But I have no choice. Don't you see, Tana? I have to go! Ugh. Erica! Oh, why is this happening? What's going wrong with the world? Tana. Tana. Why agree to invade? Emperor of Vigard is a man of peace! His people adore him! Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah, Erica's <laughs> father was the warrior king. He's the one that should have invaded. And... And... You're cutting out. You're friends with... Ha! Ah! Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's just behind it. this madness! Why is this happening? Uh, I have no answers for you, Tana. When Disney buys DC, this is what's gonna happen. Just like you mean <laughs> Mickey Mouse and talking. No, no, D Disney buying uh, oh. DC. You know, Batman talking to Mickey. <laughs> That's what I was going for. I probably should have made that more clear because. Mm. <laughs> uh, I don't want to believe it, but the reality is that we're at war. If I do nothing, I may lose my brother as well as my father. No. This is why I have to fight. It's the only answer I have. Well, maybe you need to think more. Because, <laughs> uh, only violence will lead to more violence and. Ah! Ah! Uh huh! <laughs> <laughs> Erica, you're fire emblem by Disney. Yeah. <laughs> King Hayden apologizes for being unable to spare soldiers except his best, which actually. Yeah. However, he does provide Erica with a small but trusted party of vassals. Don't no worry, Barton number stone. three is good. Erica is grateful for the king's aid. That was quiet. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. The group's first stop is a remote village of Aiden, which was until very recently. A part of Renee's. Here, Erica sees the devastation of Renee's with her own eyes, as opposed to someone else's because she's not a necromancer. Yep, that one. Seth has mapped out a route for Seth us. Seth has mapped out a route for us. Sorry. No. We'll travel south of Renee's and pass through Seraphim into Greater Territory. Mm -hmm. That would seem a sensible plan. Assuming, of course, that we can avoid any run-ins with Grado's soldiers. Princess Erica, may I, may I have your leave to scout ahead? From the sky, I'll have a better chance of spotting any nearby troops. We are yours to command, Your Highness. Will you give your permission? Uh, yes, of course. Keep an eye out for enemy bowmen, though, Vanessa. You know this. Enemy bowmen. Yes, your highness. I shall. I shall prove myself worthy of the honor of your trust. She seems very sincere. <gasps> sincere? Yes, quite. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, you old boss, we found more villagers right for the picking. Can you give him like a goofy voice? <laughs> and, oh? I, was thinking, I was thinking along the lines of a henchman from Impossible Creatures. If you've, you're familiar with the game, you're probably not. I am not. It's not a good game, but it's a fun game to mess around with. Mm -hmm. 
Maybe I'll uh, show you guys sometime. <laughs> yeah, you should. <laughs> I love a good war. With all those soldiers preoccupied, we're free to pillage as we please. Look at his nose. I right, know, Bone, right? you're in charge. Grab everything that's not nailed down and bring it to the hideout. Quick, everyone, nail your food down. <laughs> we bought it. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, bandits approaching. Tati, you take bar tray number four. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting you out of here, Ross. You stay close to me with my big buff arms. I'll be able to protect you. <laughs> oh, let's let's start, start with that village there. there. No. Go, go to a boy. It's all yours. Cut down any fool enough to get in your way, huh? <laughs> I'm heading oh west to go on the mountain to the other village. Ow. No! Uh. <laughs> Ross! What is it? What's wrong? It's nothing, it's just a scratch. You're a warrior, Dad, and I am your son. I won't be beaten so easily. Don't risk yourself so foolishly. We need to get you some help. Please, someone help my son! Take a second look at his neck. <laughs> <laughs> it's as big as his head. <laughs> oh, this looks serious. I must report back to Princess Erica at once. <laughs> Man, those guys are ugly, though. <laughs> I found them! I got bad news! The bandits, they're really ugly! The bandits are coming! <laughs> <laughs> the village of the East was under attack by bandits. Hey, God! God, they're hideous! <laughs> bandits! Did you see that guy's <sighs> nose? Damn. Wait, how big I mean, we have arrived at our first dilemma. <laughs> we must move quickly and attract as little attention as possible, but my nose might be a problem, too. <laughs> His nose would be a problem. But I cannot stand by and watch innocence be harmed! Vanessa! How fair the villagers? I spotted one injured one injured person. He appeared to be just a child. Father Mulder, can your staff help him? Well, yes, I can heal his injuries with my staff, but I cannot do but... it from here. He's too far away. I must be near. Obviously. Unless you have physics. <laughs> yeah, throw your staff over the mountain. <laughs> <laughs> He'll get it. Physics, got him. Tom, we're standing here alive where a priest mistakes a, a javelin for a staff and threw it over a mountain in an attempt to help. The victim of the attack is now dead. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Vanessa, it's up to you. Very well, I am off. Alright, so. Yeah, we're, we're a really weird wolf. I'm the really buff guy, and then they're the two girls. <laughs> uh, I kind of want to add subtitles for what your sister says. Uh, well, they should be able to hear it anyway, so. I know, but it's like one of those things you can barely hear. Mm. Spit on the fake queen. Spit on the fake queen! No. The internet. Uh, why? Because it's to assert my dominance. <laughs> Darcy is actually a very good fighter. Yeah, he is. Now I can't get that village! <laughs> you asshole! You can just talk to him with Erica and then oh, he right, can do right. it. That's all. Hey, listen. My village is being attacked by bandits. My name's Ross. 
Come on, you have to help me wipe those thugs out. Uh, alright, just take a deep breath and calm down, Ross. Leave the villages to us. We'll drive off the bandits. Seth, take the boy somewhere safe. No, wait. I'm going to fight too. But... My father is out there, all alone, fighting those bandits. I've got to get back to him as quickly as possible. I'm the son of Great Garcia. As long as I have my axe, no bandit will ever defeat me. Not true. Well, alright. I can see you're not going to be swayed. But you must promise you will stay close to us. Ooh. Training units are going to be... Potential for death. Are you going to be using them? Oh yeah. I just don't want them to die. They're some of the best units in the game because they have an extra 10 levels of growth. Nice. What's this con? Who's? Percy is, because Gilliam doesn't have enough rescue, or aid, rather. Fourteen. Okay, so it was one off. Dad! Oh, him. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Ross, boy, what did I tell you? What are you, what are you doing here? Don't worry about me. Hurry up and get yourself to safety. Did you really think I could just run away from while you were my dad? Really <laughs> it's my big guy voice. <laughs> you taught me. That That's your neck as big as your head voice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look at that neck! <laughs> oh yeah, I got that muscular neck. There's no way I'm waiting. I'm neck. fighting just like you. If he didn't have a beard, he wouldn't have a chin. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you? Alright, listen to me. <laughs> we'll cut our way out of here together. Like father and son. Hey, that's the name of the chapter. Name of a chapter in this game. Oh, nice. The most wonderful man rescued me. He was dressed like a mercenary, but he had an air of elegance about him. He gave me this elixir. I'm sure it will help you on the battlefield. Oh, was it the bow guy? Was it ends? I mean, it sounds like she's describing him. It's like a mercenary, though. Oh, who wants to do her voice? Because she does come back. Oh, nice. She's kind of hot. Hey, baby, how's that going? Do you want to take her? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay, you, you can have her. <laughs> nice. <laughs> and who are you? You don't look like one of the local peasantry. Well, I have you know how not this guy he, ran. He is one of the local <laughs> best. <laughs> well, you see, actually, as you can see, this village just has some bandit troubles. I would like to help, but I have orders to follow. I am required to quit this area at once. I would ask you to aid them in this fight. Well, we're kind of already doing that, so you see, I will pay you for your trouble, of course. Nice. You got any gems? Hell yeah, gems. And the last village has a pure water. Yeah, so it's really not so, that important, but I still want to save it. You can sell it. <laughs> I can, but oops. That armory doesn't have anything too good, just slim and iron. 
There's only one hatchet in the game, isn't there? I want to say there's two. Because that's one of Ross's weaknesses, his con is really not that good. His speed more than yeah. makes up for it in the long run, but... Maybe there is only one, actually. Uh, I mean, it has 50 uses, so it should be fine. But... Yeah, there's only one. You could, like, leave it with one use until the end of the game. <laughs> you <could> fix it up. <laughs> the hammering staff is a legendary <laughs> item in this game, isn't it? Yeah, and so is the hatchet. It's really good. <laughs> I mean, it's got a weight of five, which is ludicrously low for any axe. Oh yeah, and I uh, remember what you said about multiple chapters you can recruit Amelia in? Yeah. That's only on Erica's route. It is? Yeah, E-Frame only has one opportunity. Are you sure Erica doesn't have an opportunity and then E-Frame does, or...? I'm pretty sure it's what the wiki said. Aww. I hope I'm wrong. Oh jeez, yeah. Amelia. <laughs> Would be their favorite. Speed penalty 77. Your void 14. That would be 34. That would be pretty good, but my defensive stats just in case. Maybe do 10. Maybe do 10. So they would both have to. This way. Soften them up. Did you? So, what specifically did you want the Seth picture to be? I mean, I was just like, expecting like a rough fan art of just Seth riding a horse eating a bag of chips. Hmm. Got it. Was Erica in the picture or what? Erica on the horse behind Seth, just like giving a what the WTF look. <laughs> hey, see about doing that, I guess. Yeah, this isn't gonna hit. Most likely, oh, it did. Nice. Because even just attacking gives quite a bit of experience to training units. Yeah. Make sure Mulder doesn't get attacked. I mean, he's he's got 20 HP, 9 speed. He's not that bad. 2 defense. Like, as long as 2 don't attack, you know, be fine. And vulnerabilities, pardon me, aren't expensive. Though, just to be sure, do with some knights. They're one of those Pegasus knights with a low con. So... <laughs> Yeah, I plan on using Tana, who also does have a low con, but I don't know, I like her more and I plan to get certain supports with her. I'm not gonna say what he is, what those are, but still be careful. I see. It's always a bit frustrating, though, that she starts off at level 1. Don't kill Garcia! Yeah, but grinding in this game isn't hard. You got the tower of what is it, Melny? And you can always oh, just you can always just escape if things don't go your way. Such a pain to go to the higher levels. Like anything past the second floor is just irritating. I don't remember having that much trouble with it. I don't know, I think most of the time I used it for was just training and I was kind of just grinding out the uh, the XP revenants. So, I don't know. 
Use that steel sword. The speed's pretty need to make sure. <laughs> need to make sure you don't level her up too fast. <laughs> Because gods, she'll sit around Hector. <laughs> yes. Though I'm, I, uh, I, there's a definite possibility that I'll do that with e frame <laughs> He is so good. He is. Oh my gosh. He's my favorite lord in the entire series. Even more so than Hector. And you know how I like Hector. However, I want to get him, and I can't get him. Screw you. I recommend Ike. Well... Ike's a bro. Um... Pardon my French, but you're wrong. <laughs> uh. Oh, sorry, do you not speak French? Uh, no. I'm trying to figure out how I can make this into a gag, but it's not coming to me. Oh, damn. Seth, you screwed it up. Our friends has to run. Oh crap. Wow, Ross can actually take a hit. Nice. Not. Well then. Oh, did you guys see that Detective Pikachu is coming out next month? <laughs> no. <laughs> Look, I usually like uh, Pokemon spin-off games, but Detective Pikachu, not one that caught my eyes. Actually, body attack Ross. It sounded interesting to start with, but I was looking at a bit of, like, the art today, I guess, and it just looked super goofy. Like <laughs> uh, a game about Detective also... Pikachu Goofy? Yeah. And he's no, talking. Right? <laughs> I and think he has a gruff voice as well. In the Japanese yeah, it's version, so he weird. did. Actually, Tony, do you know who's Who voice you? acting Pikachu? Um, I don't remember. It might have been Matt Merce. I don't I, know. I think there was like rumors going around that he wanted to do the role, and I think he confirmed that he wanted to, but he didn't quite get it. Hmm. Can't remember who was doing it. Uh. Yes. Ugh. West. Oh shoot, I didn't get the village. Ro uh, Ryan Reynolds will voice. Oh, in the movie? There's a movie? There's a what? Yeah. Ah, oh, well, it was just a pure water. Tati. You say it, my son, I owe you my thanks. Uh, it, it's not unnecessary. Also, you, Tati. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hold on a moment. Aren't you the great Garcia? You fought for an ace, didn't you? Oh, a fan. Well, if you insist, I'll autograph your sword. <laughs> so, do, do you know this man? <laughs> yeah, he's a total bro. He was a true commander for his until around 10 years ago. When I was a recruit, the soldiers used to tell so, so many tales about him. What the bro? I'm noticing how awesome Harris Seth has. I know, right? They called him daring, fearless fighter for Aeneas. He's fearless, he's strong, he's buff, he has no chin. <laughs> <laughs> like Gregor. <laughs> Master Grace. You must know the peril our homeland faces right now. Can we we impose upon you to lend your strength to, to Reneus once again? Get ready for sad story story time. I'm sorry. I am retired now. Oh no! I am not a soldier anymore. It's a decision I made long long ago. Master Garcia. When I was a soldier, I lived my my life fighting for my country's honor. You see, it was a pain in the ass, but I did anyway. <laughs> I left no time for my family. I spent my life fighting for for faceless, uncaring nobles. 
when my wife fell ill and died, and I met the, ch the child she had left behind. No, that's so sad. At the moment, I finally realized what my duty had cost me. No! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I stood at my wife's grave and promised her I would be a father to our son. I'm done with armies. I'm done with fighting, except to protect my son. I have, I have no regrets. I'm the boy's father. So you, sad. You blasted fool. Father, oh, what's no. all this nonsense I'm hearing? Ross! You see, I was telling you the sad story. If you're not story. going, then I will. I'm a fighter. I know I can do this. Ross, what are you saying? I... Dad, please, listen to me. I respect you more than any other man in the world. I know you gave up being a soldier for me, I know that. But how can you throw away such a big part of yourself? You're a warrior at heart. You can't give that up and be happy. Well, I don't know. Having kids is pretty awesome too. Uh, kids getting away okay, of everything. Dad, have you seen me fight? I'm not a child anymore. I'm a warrior like you. You're free to worry, but you, I can survive on my own. Yeah, I saw you do like five damage to that one guy. I was really proud. <laughs> Ross. Sad we don't talk about that. You want to challenge me, Father? I'm a fighter, the best in all of. Aid? I think so. I'm not gonna lose to you. I'm not gonna lose to anyone. You're right. Go fight. Charge the capital. You're a good soldier, Ross. Sir Seth, my bro, if these old bones of mine can still serve, I'd like to join you. Dad. Looks like my boy grew up while I wasn't looking. <laughs> That's so sad. He's so proud of his son. He's to get, he's to get, <laughs> he's tougher than I thought. Pull yourself together, Tati. He doesn't need my help. I've raised him as best I could, but he's right. He's buff and cool like me. I have nothing to fear. I should fight. I will fight. Dad. Thank you so much for your fine. Please stay the night and rest. Oh, God. Well, we would if we could, but we have much to do and far to travel. Your safety is reward enough. Ah, oh, well. My, that is when the base in your ring. Thank you. My my father gave this to me. Ah, how are you doing? I mean, it's a wonderful gift. But you should be careful <laughs> wearing such a valuable item so openly. To today's work is needed, things have become so dangerous around here. There are gold hungry thieves and bandits everywhere. The most wicked are white spies, bandits. They're cruel beyond words. If you have something you want, your life is like that and nothing. Oh Just my god. The day we assaulted some troubles and oh, it was awful. Hang on, I think I'm dying. <laughs> uh, oh, I cannot nice believe such finish. things. Are, are, are you an alien? The great <laughs> empire stole our, in our future. My hope against them was that Prince Ephraim would fail, but where has it that he's on the verge of being crushed by really those vast parts? Oh, yeah, the heart attack, definitely heart attack. These are dark days, troubled with care. Pardon me, I gotta go die. Oh. <laughs> oh. I like that guy. Frame. Flashback. Three years ago. It's time to start. Are you ready, Erica? Yes, Frame. Let's be good. Tell me, though, why do you want me to teach you to fight? I thought you didn't care for violence. Uh, I, I do not like uncivilized behavior. I think one can solve one's problems with, without fighting. And yet... And, and yet what? 
I've always relied on you to protect me, brother. I would rather not be such a burden to you in the future. So, I thought maybe I should learn to protect my- I'm your brother. Brothers are supposed to protect their sisters. It's nothing for you to worry about. It's no cause for concern. Yes, but... I am your sister. Sisters are supposed to worry about their brothers. So, I would like to learn something of swordplay. If only a little. And maybe, someday, I can protect you in your time of need. So please, Ephraim. Alright, alright. How could I say no? Honestly, once you get an idea into your head, that's it. I might as well give in. It's agreed. I'll teach you, but won't, won't hold back because you're my sister. And I want no complaining once we've started, Erica. Complain? Me? Never! Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oops, beg your pardon. Ooh, the fuck? Hey! He touched my butt. Princess, are you alright? Yes! S someone bumped into me is all. I was jarred. Highness, where's your bracelet? My bracelet? It's... gone. No. Where could it be? Did that man... I'll fight him. Don't worry about it, Seth. That bracelet was a gift from my father, but the frame needs our help. I can't let sentimentality get in the way of my duty. No, Princess. We must retrieve your bracelet regardless of the cost. You cannot lose it. Let's go. We must hurry. Okay. I think that's a good place to <laughs> end off. Uh, how long was that? 47 minutes, huh?